Early 100 has not happened. You s we got a shot of Johan Blake there. He's probably the only Jamaican in the meet, and I told you in the hurdles, there's a story behind it. The oh, races Johan. Grand Prix in Jamaica is tomorrow, so they've asked all the Jamaican stars to stay home. It's a meet that's put on by his former coach, the guy who used to coach him and Usain Bolt, Glenn Mills. But well, Blake and Mills had a spectacular falling out, so <laughs> he decided he's coming to Italy. And now he's up against the entire podium from the World Championships. He didn't make the final last year. But make no doubt about it, Fred Curley's the favorite. And Curley is in lane four. Men's 100 from Florence. <laughs> Well, in fact, it's the Jamaican out very well, but here comes Fred Curley. Omen Yala trying to catch him again, but for the second straight meet, it is Fred Curley undefeated in 2023 with back-to-back -back Diamond League wins at 100 meters. Undefeated in Australia, in the Middle East, in Asia, and now in Europe. Fred Curley is making this one heck of a 2023 season. And it's not like he's just undefeated in one event. He's undefeated at one, two, and 400 meters. Omanyala, I thought, had a better race this time than he did a week ago in Rabat. But the result is the same. Nobody close to Fred Curley. He got a good start in this one. Better start than he had a week ago. And he made them pay. Nobody else under 10. And Curley's streak in 2023 continues. And what a that treat for these giveaway. folks in Florence to get a signed bib from the world champion and Olympic silver medalist. Look, even the Italian ran well, 10-13 for Cetarelli in fifth. Well, you said it, Otto. He has not ducked any continent or any competitors so far this year. <laughs> Daylight in between him and Omanyala in second. I think that Fred Curley's biggest challenge this year is going to be making that 200-meter team. Yes, Noah Laos has a bye, but he's probably going to show up at U.S. Nationals thinking, let me run a 200 as well. We've already seen the youngster Knighton dominate tonight. He certainly is going to be in the mix, and that's before we start talking about the other 200-meter stars like Benaric in the men's 200. So that's going to be Curley's real challenge, making the 200-meter team. There's no, he already has a bye into the 100. Yeah, Curley doesn't have to run the 100 at national, so he can focus on the